Hey YouTubers, it's MacBookian here, and uh, in my last video I told you I was going to show you how to um, transfer your old iTunes uh, music from your old laptop to your new laptop, which I called home sharing, which it is called home sharing. Now when I got this for Christmas, I had to update iTunes, and when I updated it, it came with home sharing. I, I don't know if it came with it, but I just didn't notice it on my old laptop. And when I'd done it, I was thinking, right, I'm going to have to um, either use a memory stick to transfer my music or email or something like that, or an external hard drive. And I clicked home sharing and it found my old laptop via Bluetooth and it came up with all my songs from my old laptop and my videos and everything. So I clicked on it and it said import, so I imported it um, into my new laptop, which took about an hour and a half because it's quite a lot of things. So it depends on how much things you have and it all just saved it to there and when you plug your iPod in or anything you'll just say it'll be adding the same thing as your iPod even if it says um, you're adding a new library or anything don't mind, it just don't worry about it it'll still be the same so I'll click into iTunes <coughs> and um, I've got all my music here from my old laptop and the way I've done this is here where it says shared this means home sharing, which is, um, which is what my old music from. This isn't my old laptop. This is my um, nan's laptop. So I click on um, sorry, second, right shared. Click back on shared. Oh, sorry, right, okay. And you click shared, and it comes up with all my um, nan's music here. Now, um, what you do then, you click, say I want this one, I click here. I won't do it because there's something wrong with it. So you click here, and you click import. And it'll start saying here. But yours will work, but mine's not working. So it'll come up with this. It won't come up with this on yours, hopefully. It's just mine. So um, once it's finished importing, all you all you got to do is um, click Control a Once you've highlighted them all. Hang on one second. Come on. You click Command A, sorry, and it'll highlight everything. And then once you do that, you click Import, and then it'll import everything. So there. And um, yeah. So that's the easiest way to copy your music from your old iTunes library, which I found out, which is kind of a shock. Um, you have to have Bluetooth. For, you have to have Bluetooth through it, and um. If you don't have Bluetooth on your laptop, then just do the memory stick, which will probably be much quicker, I would think. But yeah, that's how I got all my music and my movies and everything. So, um, yeah, that's how I did it. Um, the easiest way possible, I think, thanks to Apple. Um, so, yeah, and um, I'll see you later. There's MacBookie in here. Um, just keeping you uh, logged up to see what you can do and the easiest way to do things. Alright, thanks.